Hi, it's Dr. Curiti, Westlake Plastic Surgery, Austin, Texas. Austin Gynecomastia Center. The case today I have is a young man, um, and he basically complains of uh, puffy nipples. And on examination here of his photos, uh, it doesn't completely show up, but he's got certainly puffy nipples, and they're bigger than he wants. He's very self-conscious of this. So uh, he also has fullness up here in the anterior axillary fold. You see this roundness here and over here. So if I just treat this area here and leave that, that's got kind of be weird. So I want to contour this as well as this. So it's, it's not just a matter of treating here, it's treating the whole upper chest, and uh, that's, that's what it's all about. Uh, in any case, today we're going to use uh, liposuction. We're going to contour the fat through this region over here, over here, here, and in here. And then I'm going to use my new carton shaver technique, which is uh, basically a device that's inserted through the side, a small incision on the side, no incision around the areola. And I actually take bites of the glandular material out. Um, and again, it works beautifully. Uh, I've been using it for quite some time. And what it does avoid is uh, incision around the areola, and I can actually get the result even smoother than I've been able to get it uh, every other way. So uh, that's what today's video is all about. So this is the cartilage shaver device. Uh, it's a, a handle. This handle controls this cannula here. And this cannula is a little bit different than a liposuction cannula because this suction cannula here just has a port and the fat is sucked in through here, but that cannot remove the gland. This actually removes the gland. It has an opening on the end, and internally it has this rotating uh, blade, if you will, and that blade takes out pieces of the gland small piece at a time and sucks it through the cannula. So what's really nice is instead of having an incision here around the areola, even though that does very nicely, it's a small incision out over here and I'm able to insert this cannula through here, get up underneath this gland, that's right here, it's causing this puffiness, and then I just run this uh, machine and, and piece by piece reduce the volume of this gland. So this is the technique here where I'm actually feeling this gland underneath and in my fingers and I'm slowly removing these pieces of gland from the bottom up. That's the device there rotating and grabbing. That's what will grab the tissue. So I'm completed on this side and I've used the liposuction device to contour the fat around the outside and actually up over here as well on the axillary apex. And then I switched over to the cartilage shaver and with this device I was able to uh, go in through this opening here, get up underneath this whole mass that was here and I've take, uh, taken that out in pieces. So now what you can probably see, get both is this is just deflated now this is done so all that tissue has been removed you can see there's just nothing here so that whole puffy is because of the the gland underneath the gland has been removed and what's going to happen is because there's no support that's just going to shrink on down and get flat just like that so that's perfect on the other side i haven't removed the gland i've done some contouring of the fat out over here but now you can see i have all this gland here you can see it actually moving around under the skin and that's still what's making this puff ditty here big time so you can see this whole dome shaped puff ditty and i have yet to remove that gland material under here that hard stuff you can see it, it'll retract that nipple easily it's just here and again through this tiny incision here i'm going to get that cartilage shaver in remove that gland and we're going to have this perfectly contoured so it's going to be amazing